Oh, but Monsieur, you are too kind. I'm too thirsty. <laughs> what can you do to slake my thirst? You do all kinds of fun things. I ordered a new kit of games. Oh. <laughs> games. <laughs> are you okay, Big <sighs> Julian? Huh? You look a little out of it. Perhaps a brandy might help. Oh, well, I already told room service to bring us up a bottle. Good. I need <laughs> it. <sighs> My father is disinheriting me. How come? Oh, well, you may ask, as I've asked myself the same thing a thousand times since that horrid night on that prom boat. One thing I know for sure, though, Ivy's to blame. She got me on that boat that led directly to father turning against me. Well, she is something, that wife of yours. Yes, but she's going to pay. I'll have my revenge. But how? How do I uncover Ivy's secrets? I can't believe your father is turning against you. Not his, has. It's a fait accompli. Well, I remember hearing you talk to him on the phone, and you were always making nice. Yeah. Apparently, not nice enough. He's really serious about disinheriting you. Wow. Well put. <sighs> it's a definite wow. I'll be tossed aside like so much rubbish and Ethan put in my place. <laughs> well, you, you really can't talk to him? Not right now. I'll just have to ride it out. In the meantime, there's sweet Ivy. She's going to pay for setting this into motion. She's been up to something for months now. What it is, I just haven't been able to put my finger on it. Not yet, but I will. Have you looked through her papers? What papers? The ones she keeps locked up in her attache case. Do tell. Hmm? They're stashed away in her room. A locked attaché case. Mm. What makes you think there's something incriminating inside? When I was Ivy's maid, I walked in on them once and I saw her putting these real important looking documents in her case. And when she found out that I'd gotten a look, she was so mad. I thought she was going to fire me. What did she say? She just locked the case up and told me to forget that I'd ever seen it. Thanks for the tip, Suzanne. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> ah, Where are you going? To find those papers. They may be just what I need to nail my wife to the wall. Well, oh, there they are, the lovebirds. Mm. Uh, have you seen Ivy? Yes, uh, earlier she was taking a walk in the park. Good. I, it's good that she's out for some air. You know, Ethan and I still have some planning to do. Mm. Uh, there was something I think he was going to try and talk me into. Mm. Good night. Ooh, have fun. <laughs> good night, Father. <laughs> right at attaché case is here someplace i told father i'd find proof that ivy was up to something but where is that bloody case <coughs> and just what do you think you're doing here julian isn't it rather obvious get out not until i find what i am looking for there is nothing in this room that even remotely concerns you. I beg to differ with you, darling. There is an attaché case that contains certain documents. And it's here someplace. Where's the case, Ivy? Why have you been hiding it all these years? Papers. I have no idea what you're talking about. This is me you're talking to, Ivy. Mm-hmm.
Don't make trouble where there is none, Julian. Especially with Ethan's wedding this close. Yes. I wouldn't want to make things difficult for my son. Not now when he's siding with me against Alistair. Yes. <laughs> right, I think you should keep Ethan as an ally. Mm. You need all the friends you can get. Hello. Oh, you do have those papers in a very safe place, don't you? Yes. They're in a safe place. They're locked in the attaché case. Nobody will ever know that Ethan is Sam Bennett's son. If Julian were to find that attaché case, everything would be lost. Susanna's right. There are papers. 